On the first day of this year, North Korean leader Kim Jong Un sent handwritten New Year's greetings to the people for the first time since taking office in 2011. Kim also made a visit to the Kim Sasan Palace of the Sun, where the bodies of his father and grandfather are laid. North Korea, that had faced the toughest challenges last year with international sanctions, damage from typhoons and floods, and COVID-19 pandemic, assured in the new year with celebrations. The North is expected to open a rare party congress this week to reportedly unveil its economic scheme and policy directions on the U.S. and South Korea.